everyone, it's Emily. Welcome to Mama From Scratch. Today I'm gonna to be sharing with you a huge Dollar Tree Valentine's Day decor haul as well as unboxing all of my Valentine's Day decor for you. I thought it'd be perfect to combine the two videos into one and just show you everything. I don't have that much, but there's still quite a bit to get through, so I hope that you guys will enjoy this style video. So we'll just jump right in. The first thing I got from Dollar Tree was this three heart hanging sign. I thought this would be perfect. I cannot wait to share with you guys um, Valentine's Day DIYs as well as winter decor DIYs. I will be having an, one coming out for you the coming Sunday. Um, that'll be the kickstart of all the DIYs for you guys. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out on those. Um, I'm loving this love sign. They also had this in red, but I love the galvanized heart on it. It's even rippled. It's just awesome or wavy, whatever you want to call that. They had this one, which I thought was so pretty. My sword never carried this last year, and I just think this is so nice, and I love the burlap on it. You don't even have to DIY this, but you totally could if you wanted to. The other thing I got as well were these cute gift bags, and these are double-sided. Uh, well, there's two gift bags, so they're single-sided. You know what I'm saying. <sighs> Can't get my words out today. So they say the same thing on each bag, but you get two different bags. And I just thought they were so cute. They have a great variety. And if you haven't seen what Dollar Tree has for Valentine's Day decor, I will leave my Shop With Me link down below because they have a ton, and so does Target. Target's coming out with a lot of new goodies. I'll have both of those videos linked down below for you to go watch next. Um, but I picked up this XOXO sign. You even have slots so you can actually hang it on the wall if you wanted to. Um, but I thought this was a great quality for a dollar. This is something that you would find at Target dollar section for usually around five. So I was really happy about this. It's not wood, it's plastic, but hey, I'll take it. I got roses. I couldn't remember how many white roses I had, and so I wanted to pick up a few. And you get, I think, six um, roses to one thing, which is pretty good. And I loved this, this pink that they had. I thought it was so pretty. And then there's a couple things I did not get that were not Valentine's Day. Well, I guess this could be Valentine's Day. Are these three arrow hearts? They are wall decal. I thought those would be great. I got this candle votive. I love how farmhouse it is. It's, I have good plans for this little guy. And then I just got some craft sticks. I don't remember exactly what I picked these up for, um, but you will see it if I do remember that part. But this is my uh, Valentine's Day decor that I saved from the last two years. And so let's get into that part. I have this sign, and I actually got this at Home Goods for $2.80. It was originally $11, and it was on clearance. And so I have always had this. I think I've had this for like five years or something, but it's just so cute. I love the yellow and the yellow, the pink and the red on it. I'm gonna hear, you're gonna hear the word love a lot, so keep a count if you want to. <laughs> um, I made this DIY uh, arrow sign out of tacks. I love it. And I will have all of the videos for any DIYs that you will see in here. I'll have those linked down below so you guys can go watch those. So if you guys want to get a jump start on all that, you can. This is from the Target dollar section last year, the year before. I think it was $3. It's actually a cutting board, but I just display it in the house. I think it's really cute. And I obviously, everything says love on it. What are you going to do? I saved these two bags from last year. I have this felt heart from Target. It was a dollar and you could hang it, but it's actually like for um, putting cards into, but I just displayed it. And then I have, oh, I love this DIY. It's from last year. My, um, what is this called? My paper heart. I think it's so cool. I love the vintage vibe to this. It's just so cool. And I want to just do more of these. I really like this. It's so pretty. Um, it's super easy too. So that video will be linked down below. I have the heart still. He kind of got a little squished because I had to fit him in my little box. Um, I have a couple supplies left over like the little heart picks. And then I have these. I'm pretty sure these little boxes. Oh, there's candy or something in there. Probably you know, saving the goods for next time, I guess. Um, but they're the little hearts to say XO and kiss me. I have some red ones too somewhere in here. Um, but I thought, I think these are from Dollar Tree, I think from last year. I have my other paper heart, I like this. Um, I know not everybody loves to decorate for Valentine's Day or they like to do something a little bit more on the subtle side, so I really like the vintage vibe to that because you can add it and it's not overpowering. And a lot of people sometimes don't like color, so it just kind of depends on what you want to do. I also have my heart, whoa, my heart garland right here. I love these, they're so cute. And everything is really simple to make and it's obviously everything is stored right here in the box. 
I have my other heart garland. Um, I think this is from Dollar Tree. I don't remember, but it's a fun way to decorate and they come apart too. <laughs> so you can link them together or make it longer, shorter, however you want to do that. And then I have this heart garland is from Target, which they do have this year. They also have it in black and gold. I showed that in my shop with me. Um, so I decided this and you can put the Valentine's Day cards on it because it has the clothespins on the back. And then I have my other garland heart, which is the paper ones. I love the vintage ones, so pretty. And then I have this DIY block that I made out of Dollar Tree stuff as well. That was from, I think, two years ago. Ooh, more garland going through here. I have this is from Target, I believe. It's a double-sided heart, and it's made of that thick, I don't know what this stuff is, but it's heavy. They just have plain ones so far this year, but you could totally DIY, you know, letters on them and stuff. But I love it. it's two-sided and it sits on its side. So much fun. I have some dish towels. These are from Dollar Tree as well. I have my love little plaque. He's cute. I like them. I think Dollar Tree probably have these out this year. I think last year they had them in silver and I think pink, but I like the red. Or maybe that's all they had, I don't remember. <laughs> oh, there's my red one, my little red heart. And then I have this um, sign, which is from last year. I tell you, Dollar Tree's making it harder and harder for us to DIY some of their stuff because they're making it look pretty already done, <laughs> which I know for the non-DIYers, they appreciate that. Um, and then I have this, oof, dust. Whoa, <laughs> this was underneath my bed. I might be sneezing here in a minute. Um, this is actually three different hearts. I just wrap my um, stuff in saran wrap to store it. Stuck to me. Uh, and then I just DIY the back of it. So it's kind of nice. You can have two different things for it. A chalkboard and then you have the vintage one. Um, I have this heart from Target. This is $3. Um, you can hang it. I have this wood sign right here. This one is just painted, which is super easy to do. It's $3. You can hang it up wherever you want to do. And Target right now has this slotted ones that have a little bit of space in between them, which I think would be so pretty for um, different you know projects that you want. I think they're three dollars. So you guys can go watch both of my shop with me's for Valentine's Day as well as farmhouse decor. By clicking here, let me know what your guys' favorite product was out of here and what your favorite DIY is that you guys have ever created. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up. I will have a decorate with me for winter coming out this week as well as. DIY so make sure you're subscribed I hope you guys have a beautiful day thank you again so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one